Well, the world remains focused on COVID-19. A more deadly illness remains a largely hidden statistic. 17.5 million people die of cardiovascular disease every year. And as Paul Rees reports from Gothenburg in Sweden, a new life-saving solution is patrolling the skies. This is a drone on a unique mission, with a cargo that can stop the deadliest killer among all diseases. Sweden's emergency services are the first in the world to use drones to dispatch defibrillators, a crucial intervention during sudden cardiac arrest. When somebody's heart stops, this can help get it started again. So by the time an ambulance arrives, it's not already too late. Stand clear of patient. About seven out of ten sudden cardiac arrests in Sweden happen in the home, but very few homes have emergency and medical equipment. So having a defibrillator drop out of the sky within minutes can save countless lives. Globally, cardiovascular disease kills around a third of the 150,000 people who die each day. This rescue system is run here at Everdrone, a company working with experts at Sweden's Karolinska Institute and the emergency services, who trigger a drone as soon as a cardiac arrest is called in. The service went live for 80,000 people in Gothenburg from Monday. Worldwide coverage is the ultimate goal. 90% of all people suffering from cardiac arrest die. We need uh, people providing high quality CPR and we need a defibrillator on site within the first minutes. For each minute that passes by, some 7 to 10% uh, decrease in survival. So after 10 minutes, 12 minutes, uh, there's almost no chance of surviving a cardiac arrest. 73-year-old Lars Beck is one of the lucky ones from the pre-drone days. His ambulance took 20 minutes to reach him Fortunately, his neighbor was trained in resuscitation. That the drone can arrive so quickly is phenomenal, especially for those who live far away. It's important people know just how soon they can get a defibrillator and stop someone dying. Our part in this is to supply the emergency response uh, organization with more tools to respond to an emergency in a faster way. That's a fantastic thing about it, that uh, we are actually deploying a drone system that can start saving lives as of today. It could be timely. One study in northern Italy suggests cardiac arrests have gone up during the coronavirus crisis, while ambulance response times are slower. But even without the impact of COVID-19, Help from above could flatten the curve of a disease that was with us long before the pandemic and which is not about to go away. Paul Rees, Al Jazeera, Gothenburg, Sweden.